The first thing to bear in mind when you're using Photoshop Touch is that it isn't a replacement for its desktop equivalent. Although an impressive amount of features have made the transition from one to the other, you'd have to spend a hell of a lot of effort getting the same results on a tablet as you would on a PC. With a $6.99 price tag as well, this app is too expensive to justify a casual purchase for a one-off use. So why on earth would you download Photoshop Touch at all? Well, it's the best photo editing app for Android we've tested to date. If your career involves sketching out photo designs on the go and testing out your ideas while they're fresh in your mind, you'd be a fool not to give this a download. Such of a number of features written into this offering, they can be a little bit baffling if you try and dive straight on into the app at first, especially since most effects have been given modified touch controls to suit the platform you're working on. Thoughtfully, Adobe have included tutorials for almost every major editing technique, which are both detailed and intuitive. Amongst the many bits of magic you can whip up with Photoshop Touch, there are options to edit images across separate layers, merge different photos into a single picture, and add multiple effects to your snaps from a subtle blur to extravagant pirate hats. Because these are proper design techniques, they're not the kind of things you can do with a touch of a button. You'll have to learn each trick, but thanks to the combination of those tutorials, an easy button layout, and some superb touch controls, this won't be a problem. As we said at the start of this review, the end results of your touchscreen endeavours will be pretty good looking, but they won't be perfect. For an Android tablet design app though, it's really tough to envision how Photoshop Touch can be bettered, until its next edition, that is.